So this is Elite 78 Great Maverick unboxing review. Uh, I've been after this figure for a suck a long time because it's just a figure that I missed out on when I stopped collecting for a while. So let's get this out of the box. The rest of the set was Great Maverick, our truth that I do own. I do own that R Truth 24 cent title. Don't know any of the other figures on the set. So let's unbox this one. Just gotta do my little magic trick. Today, on my birthday of all days, to Oh uh, yep. Yeah. Get the crusty little box cover. Is it gonna work? How are we gonna do this? It helps if I at the right side next, yes it would be. It would be a real help. Well, that just fell apart quickly. I thought the box cut was going to help, but apparently it didn't. <laughs> apparently it didn't. So, there's the box. Let's get the rest of the figure. There's no zip ties on the back, which I do like. The less zip ties, the better. Oh no, there is one annoying little zip tie. Minus points. Minus points for uh, having zip ties. I know it's to keep the figures in, but it's annoying to me to unbox. <laughs> so, nearly there. There we are. Right, so it's accessories first. First accessories we do have is the Wanted 24-7 R-Truth poster, which looks perfect, couldn't have really done this any other way, I wouldn't have lots it to have been a plastic thing, so a cardboard thing would be nice, the extra hands we do get with these figures, with with these figures, it buys us two, no, it's just one pair of top hands, uh, I might try these on Drake later and see what they look like, but for now I don't think they would work, they seem a bit big I don't know depends depends considering you're doing it from the wrist from the wrist I think it could work so let's have a look at the other accessory that comes with this great maverick figure great maverick elite I should say Just hang on a minute let's see if I can get this out of the package in it's the Maverick 24 7 shirt uh, I do love this shirt I wish I owned this real shirt in real life and hopefully I will one day if I can find it uh, now for the articulation itself head perfectly fine here I do have a little don't know if it'll pick it up on camera but there's a little dot by the head you can see that there. Heads, rather than that, the head scan is perfect. Articulation of this figure. Sure, it doesn't have the double joints, but known figures at the time had double joints. Back, perfectly fine. Arms move fine. Leg rotation. It's alright. It moves a bit. Moves a bit. Is this double joint and legs? Nah, not double joint. Oh, wait, no. Yes, double joint and legs. Why do they have double joint legs? It's weird. It's weird. No double joint legs, but double joint his arms. Nope, other way around. Double joint legs, but double, double joint arms. So overall, I will give this a 9.5 out of 10. Only problems I had is because my figure had a little dot that's there. Plus there's a spot there. Which, no, don't like that. But rather than that, and a little bit of a red dot on the rest tape. I never noticed him with red dot on his red tape. So, let's see quickly before I get... Yeah. I'll stick with a 9.5. So, overall, an amazing figure. I think this figure did get a lot of rap, though, for people who complain about the hands. Extra hands. But, I have no issue. It looks perfectly fine to me. So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed. If you want to like, subscribe, do whatever you want. <laughs> do whatever you want, but... 
it'll benefit me in the long run get more people viewing the videos and hopefully yeah just hopefully you enjoy uh i hope you see more and hopefully enjoy the rest of your day thank you and bye